You have found a lump and you have been told it is a fibroadenoma, but you are still worried about it. Can it turn into a cancer? Should you have it removed? Or is it safe to just leave it alone? Stay tuned to find out. Hi, my name is Dr. Tasha, here to help you navigate the world of health in general and breast health specifically. What is a fibroadenoma? A fibroadenoma is a non-cancerous breast lump that commonly occurs in young women. It's made up of both glandular and connective tissue. Think of it as a small rubbery lump that moves easily underneath the skin. Fibroadenomas primarily affect women in their reproductive years, typically between the ages of 15 and 35. However, they can occur at any age. They're more common in women who have not yet reached the menopause. And there are several factors that contribute to this. Hormonal fluctuations, for example. Now, hormonal fluctuations, particularly estrogen, play a significant role in the development of fibroadenomas. These lumps often emerge during puberty, when estrogen levels rise and breast tissue undergoes rapid growth and changes. Reproductive stage. As mentioned, fibroadenomas are more common in women of reproductive age. During this period, hormonal fluctuations are more pronounced due to menstrual cycles, pregnancy and breastfeeding, all of which can influence the growth of fibroadenomas. Breast density. Younger women tend to have denser breast tissue, which may provide a more conducive environment for the development of fibroadenomas. Now, let's talk about symptoms. The hallmark of a fibroadenoma is a painless lump in the breast. It is usually round or oval shaped with a well-defined border. Imagine a tiny pebble or pea within the breast tissue. Now, the way we investigate any lump is by using an ultrasound scan if you're under the age of 40, complemented with a mammogram if you are over 40. Fibroadenomas have characteristic features, not only when we examine it, but also what it looks like on an ultrasound scan and a mammogram. If you're over 25 years, it is likely we will need to do a biopsy to confirm the diagnosis. Now, let's address some common questions people ask about fibroadenomas. Are fibroadenomas cancerous? No, the answer to that, fibroadenomas are not cancerous, they are benign. However, it's essential to get any breast changes evaluated by healthcare professionals to rule out any other condition. Can fibroadenomas turn into cancer? No, fibroadenomas themselves do not turn into cancer. Do fibroadenomas need to be removed? In most cases, fibroadenomas do not require any treatment or surgical excision at all, because they may even disappear on their own. However, if the fibroadenoma is large, if it's growing, causing symptoms, or if there's uncertainty about the diagnosis, then surgical removal may be recommended. I hope that's helpful. I'll see you in the next one.